The defeat was celebrated in the Singala South. Uh, loss of Tamil civilians' life was immense. UN estimates that 75,000 Tamil civilians were killed in the final months and that the uh, Sri Lankan military was culpable for uh, war crimes and crime against humanity. After the war, instead of seeking political settlement with Tamils, Mahinda Rajapakshi unrolled a de facto militarized siege of the um, uh, Tamil speaking areas and population. Hardline approach to the Tamils and their demands was also linked to new and more assertive foreign policy. The government turned away the long established pattern of alignment with the Western states and India. The Western was blamed for forcing Sri Lanka into negotiating into LTT in the first place. The anti empathy to West grew as US allies pushed, pushed, pushed for accountability at the UN Human Rights Council. There is no long there is a long standing mistrust of India among Singhala Buddhist nationalists who see it as a source of historic. Tamil invasion. Rajabaksha translated the sentiments into policy, pushing back against India in Indian attempt to forge closer economic ties and constitutional uh, settlement of Tamil questions. Uh, uh, in place of these ties, Rajabaksha ostentatiously set out to forge new alliance, principally with China, but also others who were seen as more respectful, respectable, respectful of national sovereignty. The government distanced itself from the overtly pro-market liberalization policies of previous administration and went instead of infrastructure investment and welfare-driven approach funded in a large part by bilateral and commercial market debt. Um, uh, the uh, the novelty of the Rajapaksha brought was the reliance on international commercial debt to fund public expenditure, including vastly expanded military. They believed that the Chinese rice, Sri Lanka's location on the east-west um, trade lanes would become prized asset. They are confident in the global competition for power triggered by China's rise, international actors would be compelled to seek Sri Lanka's favor for fear of losing it to other side. This is with this geopolitical calculus in mind, they assured the rebuffed Western and Indian demands. None of them great powers who were supposed to be competing for Sri Lanka's favor has stepped up to offer bailout, although um, the, sum, the sums are quite small by global standard. Going to IMF will require the concession on human rights and go good governance to secure the preferential access to European markets. At the same time, Indian bilateral assistance was co conditionalized on clearing controversial investment. The irony of Sri Lanka's push for total sovereignty autonomy is that it, it has given international actors more leverage than they had before. International actors who really want to help Sri Lanka would use this leverage to push for tangible and non-reversible changes in the uh, treatments of Tamils and Muslims, whatever leader, leadership emerges in Colombo. Next, uh, Next article that we are moving into is related to Heritage Get Its Due. Um, Dara, an OD, an OD uh, to in Indian Knowledge System, is a Ministry of Culture's flagship initiative in this direction. It is conceptualized as a series of lecture demonstrations dedicated to the specific areas of inquiry, highlighting India's contribution and achievements across the domains. Dara embodies the idea of continuous flow of information and knowledge from one age to another, being adopted and questioned and evolved over time, so that when we are not only move ahead to the next level of insights across various fields, but, all, but do so on back of findings and deep understanding already available to us. It is impossible to imagine the advent of a modern world without the concept of modern mathematics. But these concepts are not really modern. They are born in India several centuries ago. For the modern world, it was the Greek mathematician Archimedes who produced the first known summation of an infinite series. However, it was used by Madhava, 1400 CE to find the approximate value of pi. Uh, uh, Arabic numerical system owes its origin to the Bakshali, Ma Bakshali manuscript, the first surviving reference to um, Indian numerical system. Uh, numerical system. This system was transmitted to Arab world by around 800 CE and was popularized by the Persian mathematician al Khwarizmi and the philosopher al -Kin Kinti. From the Arab world, it was transmitted to Europe by around 1100 CE. It was Brahma Gupta who established a way back in 7th century CE that the produce the product of depth negative number and the fortune that is positive number is a depth negative number. Similarly, it is Fino Nazi series, in ingenious work of Viranka or Pascal's triangle, Pingala Meru Prastra, ancient India's contribution to modern mathematics has been dominant and consistent. We all know. We all know that India was a center of trade. Little is mentioned about India as being center of manufacture. Damascus ward with a uh, high carbon content of 1.5 to 2.5 percentage, known to have the ability to cut the even 
goose kerchief were made from wood steel in india till 19th century wood steel swords and daggers are made at the center such as lahore amritsar agra jaipur gwalior tanjore uh, mysore and golconda the, the manufacturing process was forcibly banned by british in the mid um, 19th century the art was lost <coughs> while the certain uh, thought leaders in west prohibited interest on borrowing terming it as sin ancient philosophers like, philosophers like kautilya advocated interest rates that varied with risk okay next article that we are moving into is related to what is flight risk okay before that um, let us see uh, solid fuel ducted ramjet system which enables a missile to Uh, intercept aerial threats uh, let us see what is uh, in detail what is it's all about drdo successfully flight is solid fuel uh, ducted ramjet technology so- solid fuel ducted ramjet technology is a missile propulsion system that includes a thrust modulated ducted rocket with a reduced smoke nozzle less missile booster it utilizes a solid fueled air breathing ramjet engine unlike solid propellant rockets ramjet take up oxygen from the atmosphere during flight thus it is light in weight and can carry more fuel as per drdo sfdr that is solid solid fuel ducted ramjet uh, uh, based propulsion enables the mission to intercept aerial threats at very long range at supersonic speed sfdr uh, helps to develop long range air to air missile the ramjet is a form of air breathing jet engine that uses a vehicle forward motion to compress incoming air from the combustion without a rotating compressor ramjet works most efficiently at supersonic speed around mach 3 and can operate at a speed of mach 6 however ramjet efficiency start to drop at hypersonic speed other types of air breathing systems are scramjet and dual mode ramjet scramjet is a supersonic um, combustion ramjet engine it is an improvement over the ramjet engine it is efficiently operates at hypersonic speed and allows supersonic combustion uh, dual uh, mode ramjet uh, dm rj a type of jet engine where the ramjet transforms into a scramjet over mark 4 to 8 range which means it is efficiently operate both in the subsonic and supersonic combustion mode this is what the article uh, talks about next article is who is a flight risk um, cba look at circular against former um, amnesty india chief agar patel continues to be argued in the court when when is an loc issued to prevent someone from leaving the country when uh, when can court set it aside A district court in Delhi on Friday states a magistrate ordering directing the CBA to withdraw its uh, uh, lookout circular against the uh, uh, former Amnesty International India Agar Patel asked him not to leave the country without the permission of the court. Uh, CBA director also apologized to him. Patel made a second attempt to leave the, on Thursday night but stopped against the immigration in Bangalore. LOC that is uh, lookout circular is issued to prevent a person from leaving the country. It is issued by various ag- uh, agencies and government bodies. is to the bureau of immigration in a in a prescribed format with the detail of the person who intends to prevent from going abroad boi that is a bureau of immigration maintains a registration of success circular which is informally called exit control list the agency that, that has issued the loc boi is not authorized to arrest or detain anyone mm. The agency that had issued the LOC and LOC is invalid for only one year and has been reissued after its expires. According to Ministry, of, who can issue such a circular against the citizen of India? According to Ministry of Home Affairs, LOC are inevitably a large number of author, authorized um, authorized officers who who include an officer not below the rank of Deputy Secretary to the Government of India, an officer not below the rank of Joint Secretary in the State Government, um, or District Magistrate or Superintendent of Police, or designated officers of various law enforcement security agencies, or designated law officer of interpol officer not below the rank of additional director in uh, sfio ministry of corporate affairs and officer be not below the rank of chairman um, or uh, as per the directions of any of the criminal courts in india apart from the state police loc can be issued by the cba national investigation agency enforcement directorate narcotics control bureau and directorate of revenue and intelligence cbd dt uh, cb ec uh, intelligence bureau research analysis wing um, under which is a, uh, what circumstances one issued means uh, uh, recourse to loc has been taken in cognizable offence under ipc or other penal code supposed to provide reasons for opening loc in the prescribed per- 
ஃபோ ஃபார்மா வித்தவுட் விச் சப்ஜெக்ட் ஆஃப் அன் எல்ஓசி வில் நாட் பி அரெஸ்டட் ஆர் டிடைன் ஹோம் மினிஸ்ட்ரி ஆஃப் ஆஃபீஸ் ஆஃப் மெமரண்டம் டூ தௌசண்ட் டென் அனௌன்ஸ்ட் அனதர் கேட்டகரி ஆஃப் எக்ஸப்ஷனல் எக்ஸப்ஷனல் சர்க்கம்ஸ்டன்ஸ் வேர் எல்ஓசி கேன் பி இஷ்யூட் வித்தவுட் அ கம்ப்ளீட் பெராமீட்டர்ஸ் அ கேஸ் அகேன்ஸ்ட் அரெஸ்ட் ஆண்டி நேஷனல் எலமெண்ட்ஸ் இந்த நேஷனல் இன்ட்ரெஸ்ட் வாட் லா கவன்ஸ் த இஷ்யூன்ஸ் ஆஃப் எல்ஓசி தேர் இஸ் நோ ஸ்பெசிஃபிக் லா எல்ஓசி இஸ் இஷ்யூட் பேஸ்ட் ஆன் த கைட்லைன்ஸ் இட் பை மினிஸ்ட்ரி ஆஃப் ஹோம் அஃபேர்ஸ் த லெட்டர்ஸ் அந்த ஆஃபீஸ் மெமரண்டம் இஷ்யூட் இன் நைன்டீன் செவன்டி நைன் அண்ட் டூ தௌசண்ட் டென் கேஸ் இன் பாயிண்ட் இஸ் தட் கிரீன் பேஸ் கேம்பெயினர் பிரியா பிள்ளை ஹூ இஸ் ப்ரிவென்டட் ஃப்ரம் ஃப்ளைங் இன் லண்டன் டூ தௌசண்ட் ஃபிஃப்டின் பேஸ்ட் ஆன் எல்ஓசி ஓப்பன்ட் அகேன்ஸ்ட் ஹர் பை இன்டெலிஜென்ஸ் பியூரோ விச் வாஸ் கேட்டகரைஸ்ட் ஹர் ஆஸ் அ ஆண்டி நேஷனல் எலமெண்ட் பிள்ளை வாஸ் சப்போஸ் டு அட்ரஸ் த பிரிட்டிஷ் பார்லிமெண்ட் பார்லிமெண்டேரியன் அகேன்ஸ்ட் த மைனிங் ப்ராஜெக்ட்ஸ் இன் மத்திய பிரதேசம் வென் கேன் எ கோர்ட் செட் அசைட் ஆன் எல்ஓசி கோர்ட் கேன் குவாஷ் எல்ஓசி இஃப் இட் If has not been issued in a prescribed format or in an authorized agency or officer. It can also set aside LOC if it feels the ground of our issuance of LOC are not fulfilled. This is basically means if the court is of opinion that despite a criminal case against the subject, he or she is not a flight risk, has been cooperating with the investigating agency, it might quash the LOC. Next article that we are moving into is related to RBI's um, RBI's policy thrust, uh, Reserve Bank's policy thrust to monetary tightening to tackle inflation. Uh, Reserve Bank of India has decided to keep the main policy uh, policy rate, repo rate unchanged at 4%. It has also retained its accommodative stance but indicated it will engage in gradual and calibrated withdrawal of surplus liquidity to rein the inflation. Central Bank has now decided to focus on inflation overgrowth by sucking out money from the system in a multi a multi year time to frame what is the big picture emerging from the monetary policy review growth forecast to 7.2 percentage for fiscal 2022 to 2023 from 7.8 projected earlier uh, rbi has also increased the retail inflation projection from 4.5 percentage to 5.7 percentage in 2022 to 23 uh, the cpi uh, inflation of 4 percentage within the band of plus or minus 2 uh, what policy instrument has rbi proposed to tackle the situation rbi's liquidity management is characterized by two way operation through the variable rate reverse repo action of varying maturities to observe liquidity and the variable rate re- rate repo that is vrr actions to meet the transient liquidity shortage and offset mismatches in this review rbi has introduced standing uh, standing deposit facilities sdf a new tool for observing liquidity at an interest rate of 3 3.75 so while the monetary policy maintained a status quo on the repo rate kept the stance of accommodative it signaled the normalization of liquidity adjustment facility corridor by introducing sdf as a flow rate in the place of fixed uh, fixed rate reverse repo which was kept un- unchanged at 3.35 percentage mm. central bank Central Bank to mop up liquidity without providing any collateral. Both the standing facility, the MSF and SDF will be available on all these all days of the week throughout the year. FRR uh, rate retained at 3.35 will be main part of the RBA's toolkit and its operation will be discretion of RBA for the purpose specified from time to time. FRR along with SDF will impart flexibility to RBA's liquidity management framework, RBA said. Next article that we are moving into is related to non domicile tax status which means she is not legally bound to pay tax in uk on income earned overseas this is what the all about next article that we are moving into is related to um, next article that we are moving into is related to um a Uh, RBI hints uh, at shift in stance yields hit near 3 year high rising yield mean means investor accept a rise in the interest rate and uh, there, therefore selling the bond papers they are holding since a rise in the interest rate would result in decline in the bond price of existing bond a reverse repo out sdf in rbi's new liquidity absorbing tool in 2018 amended section of 17 of rbi act empowered central bank to introduce sdf an additional tool for observing liquidity without any collateral by removing the binding collateral constraints on rbi sdf strengthens the operating framework on monetary policy with the width of lif corridor was widened to 90 basis point by asymmetrical adjustment in the reverse repo rate versus policy repo rate the with the introduction of sdf at 3.75 percentage the policy repo rate being 4 percentage mf msf rate 4.25 percentage with of the lif is restored its pre pandemic configuration of 50 basis point that's all if you like the video please do share like comment and subscribe thank you